four. Honor guard, present. Harm. Ready. Aim. Ready. Aim. Ready. Aim. Freedom is not free. I watched a flag pass one day fluttered in the breeze. The young Marine saluted it and then stood at ease. I looked at him in uniform, so young, so tall, so proud. With hair cut square and eyes alert, he'd stand out in any crowd. I thought how many men like him had fallen through the years. How many died on foreign soil? How many mothers' tears? How many pilots' planes shot down? How many died at sea? How many foxholes are sold in graves? No, freedom is not free. I heard the sound of taps one night when everything was still. I listened to the bugler play, felt a sudden chill. I wondered just how many times the taps had meant amen, the flag had covered and burned, my comrade or a friend. I thought of all the children, the mothers and the wives, the fathers, sons and husbands with interrupted lives. I thought about a graveyard at the bottom of the sea, one of my congratulations to Mark Evans in Arlington. No freedom is not free. Our flag is the honored, most visible symbol of our country. Our departed comrade served under this flag, and is a veteran that is in the honor of having it presented to his loved ones in his memory. On behalf of the President of the United States, the Commandant of the United States Marine Corps and a grateful nation, please accept this flag as a simple appreciation for your loved one's faithful service to country and court.
And now in closing, to Almighty God we commend the soul of our comrade departed, and we commit his body to the ground, earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust, in steadfast faith that as he has borne the image of the earthly, so he shall bear the image of the heavenly in your everlasting kingdom. Amen. Military post.